What is up guys, it's your boy Souls here, welcome back to Geometry to the Dizzle Dash. You all, oh my mic is like way too high, you all ready know. Uh, what we're going to be doing today is we are going to be adding camera effects, plus maybe so a couple of filters onto the main levels of Geometry Dash. And I got three of them planned, but the main one I wanted to do was Stereo Madness. So we're not going to waste any time, without any further ado. Let's get right into it. Let's become cameramen today, baby. All right, so camera effects, we got plenty of them. Uh, as we go to this tab here, we can zoom in and out. We can make a static camera. We can offset the gameplay. All right, so first things first is we need to do some camera work. Eh, probably not here. Maybe we can do something in like this area here. So what I'll do is I'll go ahead and put like a little camera object here. So I'll put that in group one, and we'll do like an ease and ease out, and we'll have it like right here. Wow, that actually was perfect. What the heck, dude? Maybe, we'll, oh, we could probably do like a zoom out actually. 25, well, 0 0.725, and have it zoom out slowly as you get to the staircase. That's, this is actually kind of nice, having it all zoomed out, you can actually see what the heck you're doing. This is nice, this is nice. Okay, so at this part, what I can do is I can actually zoom the camera, slowly but surely zoom the camera back in. So I just gotta make sure you got back to the end of the staircase, which probably be like, I think around here should be good, yeah. Ooh, I could probably put like a, a sepia filter here as you're going to the, 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 the ship. That would be cool, that would be cool. And then right here, after the sepia, we can have it like fade off like immediately. So it gotta be like right on top of the ship right here. And then we're gonna do a bounce out camera right back to its, nor its normal size. Uh, I probably should do it the opposite way. Maybe I can do like a, a sine wave after you hit the portal. What, what if I do shock line? Yeah, yeah, let's do a shock line, but it's gonna be based off of group one. Yeah, we just need like a small little boot, you know, a small little wolf, you know. And I guess we can do some more static camera stuff here too. And do another ease in, ease out. Have like an 85 for the duration. But what we'll also do is we'll do, no, let's do a gameplay offset. Let's do a gameplay offset. I said I wasn't gonna use it, but you know what? Why not? All right, maybe the offset's kind of weird. The offset's, off, throw, the offset's throw me off. <laughs> Still looks kind of weird. Man, I can't. I feel like I can't really like rotate the camera in this part. This doesn't feel like a level that you would rotate the camera in. Edge, I don't think would work here very well. I did my static. I did a little bit of zoom. So we'll zoom out. Well, yeah, zoom out. Probably like this. Sure, we'll use that number. Oh, and then here is where we can like zoom the camera in. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that's that's a, that's the vision right there. I uh, probably should do something with the offset though. That that zooms in kind of weird. And then I guess I'll slowly zoom you out for the the triple spikes here, because I, I don't want I don't I don't want it to be completely unfair. And then here I can actually do a static camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This is kind of experimental what I'm doing here, so take what I'm doing with a grain of salt. Yeah, yeah, because it's kind of instantly statics to it, which is not ideal, personally. Not ideal. Hey, that's actually perfect. Yes, actually, yes. Yes, 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 yes. That's perfect. That's perfect. And we can make the camera zoom slower than that. And we'll have it that we'll have this assigned in time out as well. Hey, that actually worked really well. I and mean, then I can exit the static as you get to here. I'm probably gonna put the offset back to normal here. So we have regular offset and then we're gonna restart the camera essentially. Right, but all this, this this is basically getting the camera back to normal at this point. All right, so right here is we're gonna have the camera zoomed out so you can actually see the coin row. Cause that is one fatal flaw of Stereo Madness. Even though it is a secret coin, I still want it to be a fair secret coin in a way, right? And then we're going to off. Well, actually, I'll have it zoom out like around here where you can actually see the top. Hey, that's actually kind of perfect. What the heck? Yes, dude. 
Because I don't like how it like snaps like that. I don't like how it snaps like that. Okay, so the game broke again. What if I static it here? Like static, or right, so group five right here. And hopefully it like just ends properly. Okay, that actually fixed it. Thank the Lord. Why does it go up? What? Why is it going up here? Nothing up here is in group six. Okay, I don't think I need the static camera for this anymore. I, I don't think so. How would motion blur even work here? I don't even, I'm not even sure how motion blur would even work in this instance. So this hurts my eyes. Stereo Madness with camera effects done. Let's freaking go. Now we can do a small little showcase. next level that I'm going to be doing that actually inspired this video is actually Clutter Funk because there's actually a couple of parts in Clutter Funk where camera controls would actually be really, really dope. Like, for instance, the ending part to Clutter Funk right here, this would be really cool to do like a slow zoom in on the player. And there's a couple of places in here where a static camera can work. Uh, I think somebody's done this before, but I'm not entirely sure. So starting from the beginning, starting from the beginning, let's go. Okay, uh, I guess we can start off with the camera zooming out. Oh, that helps with visibility so much. Oh my goodness. All right, so we're gonna do another one of those, my camera static movement things because i really liked how it looked in stereo of madness rob top i have one request can you fix this layout we got like this massive open space here i kind of want to try something a little bit experimental i don't know how well this is going to work yeah follow camera is actually kind of goaded i'm not gonna lie okay so that clearly doesn't move fast enough boop make it go come on we got chop 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 camera man Oh, that's actually clean, dude. What in the world? Uh, I don't know if pixelate would be good here, but we're gonna surely try it. Okay, and when it hits that portal there, I can actually zoom it out. So, case okay. We can do another sign in, sign out. Hmm, we can zoom that out a little bit more. Oh, okay. Now we got to do something about this. We got to. We have to. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I got, I got some ideas. I got some ideas for the filters. So when you hit the portal here, I actually kind of want to do like a radial blur. And then I could probably do like a camera offset. Let's do camera offset. Actually, you know, I think this will work if my ball was in free mode. Let's see. And I need the camera offset to be up. So I need to make it go up. Don't be a little bit experimental with this part too. 
because we're gonna zoom the camera into this little uh this part i'm kind of in focus mode right now because i kind of i got i got some ideas that's why i'm like i'm like hmm what well, if i do this with the camera and this with the camera and this is actually where i can rotate the camera a little bit to emphasize that that uh that craziness I do have shake. Do I want to shake the camera instead? I can't just shake this. I can't just shake this instead. I think what's messing me up here is the freaking uh, movement thing. Yeah, that's way better. Alright, so now I just gotta make the camera back to normal now. Okay, so what I'll do next for this part is I'll go ahead and add another static camera. Cause I I love the static camera. I love where you I love where you can do a static camera. It's so good, dude. And then camera offset we can fix here. So camera offset's gonna reset there. Man, with filters, there's so much potential. There's so much potential, man. I'm not I'm only scratching the surface of uh, filters. I haven't really experimented with filters too too much, but just from this little bit of clutter funk work it's 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 fire this is going to be really interesting to edit with okay yeah that's completely un that's completely unfair this looks weird <laughs> that looks really weird i feel like i'm editing a video but in geometry dash bro can't really do any too much camera stuff here except for zoom out so you can actually see what the heck you're doing. All right, now we can do some like glitch effects, I guess. Let's do, should I do chromatic, just regular chromatic this time? I really like that effect. What the heck? That's actually a really cool effect. So I was gonna do a static camera here, but I changed my mind because <laughs> I was gonna have it at each island, but now nah, we're just gonna do it at the last few islands You know, it would be nice if the actual cameras actually had the numbers on the cameras That will make this so much better and my final part that I wanted to do that inspired this entire video is Zooming in on the player as you get to the ending and I probably should have to make that lip happen a little bit faster Is there like a particle that's gears? Can I make this part? Can I want I kind of want to part this, make this part rain gears Is there a gear in here? There's saws, but I don't want to use the saw. I wanted to use the gear, but I don't think there's a gear in this one that sucks. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think I am going to end the video right here. Thank you all so much for watching. Pretty simple video today, but it's pretty cool. You know, filters and geometry dash and camera effects, they're really cool. I really do like them. That is Clutter Funk, so allow your boy to showcase this glorious level.
gentlemen, I am going to end the video right here. Thank you all so much for watching the video. If you guys did enjoy these two levels, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe for more, and it's been your boy Souls here, and I will see you guys next time. Later.